Now to a danger on the baseball diamond brought to our attention when a major league player was hit in the head this week by a line drive. But it happens in the Little League, too, and here's ABC's Matt Gutman. It took about a third of a second and a shot. Oh, it hits half. for this rocket of a line drive to blast Blue Jays pitcher J.A. Happ faster than the blink of an eye, leaving players on both teams in stunned silence. Less than 24 hours later, despite having a skull fracture, J.A. Happ left the hospital feeling very fortunate. It must have caught me on a better spot because I think it could have got me head on. With the ball speeding towards him at about 120 miles per hour, Happ didn't have time to react. What can you do in a third of a second? Probably not even duck. It's a professional hazard for pitchers. Fortunately, it only happens an average of about twice a season. Our sister network, ESPN, documented the injuries. The right orbit was fractured. Fractures in my skull, internal bleeding. Now Major League Baseball is considering new protection for pitchers like these cap liners produced out of bulletproof Kevlar. But these liners only protect about 40% of the head. 60%, including the face, is still exposed. The problem, not just in the bigs. Little League teams also looking for a solution. This 11-year-old was saved by his cap bill. Their brains are still developing, so the ramifications could be worse. Absolutely. So that's what we worry about. Officials are so concerned they're working with sports equipment companies to develop a pitcher's helmet for kids and teams. Little leaguers are now coached to finish their pitch in a fielding position with a glove near the face. The best we have right now to prevent an injury that can happen in the blink of an eye. Matt Gutman, ABC News, Miami.